Welcome back to Kids to Dumb and Ground. Hi, my name is Freddie Smith and I play Kyle on the Dumping Ground. The base of the Dumping Ground is actually like an old school. There's lots of corridors with a few different openings outside. Hi, I'm Jasmine and I play Taz D'Souza on the Dumping Ground. So we are in our pod right now. We just spend all of our free time in here, you know, whenever we're getting changed, we go in our pods and if we ever want a bit of a chill out time, then yeah, that's where we go. Hi, my name's Hallie Cassell and my character is Clem Stevens. We're not on set yet. We're in the makeup room currently. I'm about to get my makeup and hair done, which I love. Could say it's my favorite part of the day, actually. My name is Michael Bertley. I'm a makeup designer and currently on uh, the dumping ground. Every character has a specific look. Um, it's to tie in with the animations, really, so that everybody has a recognisable look. My character's name is Bonnie. She likes to play pranks. She pranks everyone. She likes to put fun into everything. We've got all the bunting because it's a joyful place. Production is fun and bunting and brightness. My name's Misha McCullough. I'm a production coordinator on the dumping ground. I love budgets. It's like when you play offices when you're like young and I don't know if anyone else played offices or if they played like teachers and nurses. I always played not offices and you get to do your like paperwork and you fill out your boxes. That's very much like what a production office is. You get your paperwork that you fill out and it is very exciting. I'm Sarah Rachel and I play Floss Cubby. Um, I've been playing her for 10 years now. I spent more than half my life here than I have early at home with my parents, which is weird, but it's a family here. I've grown up with it, so. This is Studio A, where the main part of the set are in main people's bedrooms like mine. My name is Niall Abbas. My job title, I'm a first assistant director. Thank you, we see everybody. We are in the lobby of the uh, dumping ground, or the DG as we call it. This is a set in the studio, and off the sets is the kitchen, the office, the quiet room, the upstairs, and the sitting room. 12 years now. We're at 10 years on the dumping ground in two years of Tracy Beaker Returns before that. Yeah, I've been on since the very start, actually, so that's uh, 10 years, 10 series worth, so it's quite a while. It does change, it evolves, um, and, and it sure has to, to, to stay fresh. There's quite a few new characters this series, and to, to try and find who they are without much backstory, we don't really know much about them when they start sometimes. My name is Hugo Nash and my character's name is called Hugo Little. My first try being an actor. The good things are you get free food and also you get to try new costumes for free. My name is Les McCall and my character is Fraser Vassalou. My character loves football and he's very sporty, which I myself am, and it helps me kind of connect with my character. Hi, I'm Zanal. Um, my character name is Izzy. She loves building stuff and she absolutely loves her dad, but has been a bit lost without him. I'm called Flory. I play Sabrina in The Jumping Ground. She is a very moody character. She keeps herself to herself and she can be very rude sometimes to other people and make other people upset. Hello, my name is Kaylin DeWeese Louise Nagoma and my character name is called Dita. Dita is a very shy person, she's very anxious. She loves telling people facts and to help her, she whispers facts to herself and counts it on her finger to help her breathe. I grew up watching this show. I'm super honoured to be like on a show that me and my family grew up watching. When you sort of come into it, you don't sort of expect it to be so tight-knit, but everyone's so close and it's literally like having another family. 
Last series I joined with only about five weeks left, so I had to get to know everyone and this series, it was just really fun. Everyone I was friendly with, all the new cast were great. It's been great to bond with everyone. Yeah, just acting with them is such a huge bond. Because of that kind of friendship with everyone, it goes very smoothly and I think that's the best part about working here. The reason why I've been doing this for 12 years for is because I like coming back and I like um, working with the kids mainly and uh, the different crew that we have. It's a very diverse cast and I think that's its power. They all come together as one big dysfunctional family and they all eventually work out their problems and surely somebody can relate to that. Some kids come and go and some kids come back again and we see them years later and now they're all grown up and they start off little and now they're six foot two. It's an era of my life. It's actually really sad. I know I'm like, I'm getting emotional, I'm like, no. Oh.